I'm a friends. <clears throat> Welcome to my channel. Uh, I want to thank each and every one of you that stopped by to check on me, to watch me, to listen to me. <clears throat> I hope this right. That's what it, it always does. It's going to resonate with someone. If it wouldn't resonate with somebody, the Holy Spirit wouldn't send the message out. So, Holy Spirit delivers a message to me through the cards. I read the cards and I pray it over the cards. And this is what I'm going to do. Just a little different. I've done it before. Um, and basically, it's, it's a shuffle and a split deck read. Like, I'm gonna, we're going to shuffle the cards. Okay, shuffle the cards. Split the deck as such, and we read. <clears throat> um, I want to thank each and every one of y'all for subscribing to those that are new to my channel spiritual guidance 1111 I don't uh, just old country boy that reads loves God and I try to give you some guidance not advice Need to do it let this disclaimer. I'm not a lawyer, I'm not a therapist, psychologist, none of that stuff. Uh, um, I just read the cards and I let the cards, you take what you want from it and leave what's left. And we just shuffle the deck. And I shoveled them quite a bit before I came on. And I, I always pray, but I prayed before. And <clears throat> that someone we have the Ten of Cups in reverse. Ten of Cups in reverse. Ten of Cups in reverse is Ten of Cups in a, in the upright is the happiest card you can get. Elated, ecstasy, so happy. Ten of Cups in reverse is just the opposite. Very unhappy, not happy at all. Family life is it just uh, family life is uh, it's not good and uh, just unhappy they, they it's just not a happy card what uh, in whom in in finances in every cup is reversed and cups is emotion so everything that they deal with they're not happy with themselves one cup they're not happy with finances second cup they're not happy with relationships, third cup. I mean, we could go all on, on, and on. They are not happy. Very, very dissatisfied. Family, the cup with family, not happy. This is the night of cups. This person is emotional. They may be wearing a mask like there's nothing bothering them. Oh, it's bothering them. Bad. But this is reverse now, okay? I'm showing you in the upright so you can see what it's like. 
verse. Scorpio. It's in the, it's in the energy of Scorpio. This one is in the energy of Pisces. Mm. One night stands. They've had them. They've had some. Uh, they, they were, I don't know, maybe still are, but they, um, they, again, this is a sad card. It's an emotional card too, because it's a cup card. It's in the it's in the reverse. It's it's a very sad card. They y'all see me play with my mustache. I ate a, a couple of hot tamales a while ago to freaking cinnamon candy then. And I feel like it's my mustache is sticking is sticky. I ain't supposed to eat that. Don't tell nobody. Diabetic, but I just kind of like. Psh. While my bride wouldn't wash me, and my dog, he don't tell on them on me, so I'm in good shape, you know. But anyway, let's get back to this right here. Yes, this Knight of Cups in reverse. They they in the cheater energy. They cheat. They. They manipulate. They have been shown love. They have been given love. True love. They have been given true love. And they offer back unrequited love. They, they don't. They, so Let's do this again. We're going to do another one. i shuffle and we'll do another split. <clears throat> Temperance in upright. High priestess in the upright. This person is a I hate to say, you know I hate to say was because I, I believe that once you're spiritual, you're always spiritual. You just get off of the spiritual path. You're still spiritual. You just got off of that spiritual path. Uh, and uh, this one is, it's a moon card. You know, it, what it is, is, is a, um, and it deals with, uh, I. But it is a, a spiritual cord. The high priestess in the upright. <coughs> Still fight the dog on cool. Don't want to turn loose for sure. They looking for some stability, emotional stability. They're tired of dealing with emotions they want to they want to find some emotional stability they also they have been to readers they have that's a fact temperance is balanced they want some balance in their lives they want you know, and, and who does it? Who does it? The 
last reading we just had, they have unrequited love. Perhaps in that situation, they love somebody that wasn't giving back to them like they were giving, perhaps. That's what it appears. And the temperance, if you, if you want to see, let's see if I can show you, get a steady here. See, I pour one cup into another. You pour one cup into another, Cups is emotion. They put a, a lot of emotion into someone. A lot. They took emotion from somebody. Meaning they may have had someone else. They took the emotion that they had from them and they gave it to somebody else. And... Uh, Temperance is also moderation. They need to moderate themselves. They need to balance themselves. Uh, and and when, I'm, when I say that, I mean with everything. Everything in life needs moderation. You need balance in everything. Once you begin to overdo something, that's when things go wrong. Uh, with uh, any kind of vice. When I say advice, I mean any kind of an addiction. It can, it can go terribly wrong in a short amount of time. I have a friend that had a friend. <laughs> I had past tense. When it came to moderation, she used to tell me, and then what she said was the truth. What she said was the truth. This can apply in two ways. She would tell me a drunk man's words is a sober man's thoughts. Made a lot of sense too. What she, what she meant was, and what the meaning is, is that drunk people say things that that same person thinks about. It's just they just need a little bit of liquid encouragement for it to come out. Same applies to demons. When you have a demon in you, you say things that normally you would not say. That demon is the one that's talking. Your thoughts, they say it. You think it, they know it, and they say it. When you when you don't have a clue, when you, this could be something that you cannot remember, you never said, and they could have that information device that shows, and they can hit that record button, and they can even let you listen to yourself saying what was said, and you still don't remember. It's a fact. But anyway, <coughs> I think she told me that one time, and I never forgot what she said. Of course, I don't forget. I remember. That's one thing God gave me. <coughs> it was a good memory. You saw me shovel the deck, I just split the cards. Got the magician in the upright. The magician is the second card in the tarot. You go from the fool, the fool begins the journey in tarot. You begin that, that, that tarot journey. And the magician, it's the first card after the fool. Yes. The other card is the Two of Swords. It's in the Libra energy. Yes. Libra energy. See, when the fool takes off on his journey in Tara, and you have to look at Tara, and I'm not giving instructions. Please don't, un don't confuse this. I'm not giving advice. No, <laughs> not teaching. This this is a lot of years of of the 
developing the craft. Every reader is going to tell you that you do not just start reading cards. No. No. That don't happen. It takes a lot of years to develop your craft. Not to mention, you got you, you, if you don't have the gift, you can just say what you want. It ain't going to. But anyway, let's get back to this. Think of this as, I don't know if any of you ever played the video games or whatever. You got a little avatar, and the avatar takes off on a little journey. Do, 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 do. And he goes to the next, first station. At that station, that little avatar, he stops at the magician. And he talks to the magician. The magician asks him, I got some, some skills. I got some tools. I got a sword. I got some pentacles, a cup, mm -hmm. a wand. What you want to take with you on your journey? And that fool, he takes whatever tools that he thinks he's gonna need. But you see, he don't know yet what's down the road, down the, the path. You know, he's gonna go through some stages, which is the Arcanas. And then when he's going to get to, to the path that winds up in the four, which is swords, cups, wands, and pentacles, then he's going to decide which one he's going to go on. And that path, can, those, that path crosses, as I've explained before. Anyway, the magician is something that the person that this is going to resonate with, it's skill they good at what they do what whatever their profession is they good at what they do i'm a toll boater i consider myself good at what i do <sighs> i've achieved most of the goals that i've set for myself <sighs> oh mercy Ooh, Lord, I'd be glad when I kick this. Uh. <clears throat> they have a lot of willpower. Supposedly. And it goes directly against the card with temperance. So, they have willpower when they want to achieve something. They have willpower when it comes to work. Whatever pleasures they have, and some people have different pleasures. Let's say they enjoy a craft. Like... My bride, she does flowers. She plays with her flowers. She makes arrangements and things like that. She's good at what she does. Cooking. So, that being said, let's go on with the uh, let's go on with the reading. This person is. They feel like they had an impasse. They 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 had one of them crossroads. But they hate making a decision. When you make a decision, and with this, with this, the one that this is going to resonate with, when they make this decision, they feel like, well, no matter what I'm going to do, I'm going to lose on this. <clears throat> I'm going to lose no matter what. Do I stay on the, the road I'm on? Because there's a fork in the road. Do I stay on the road I'm on? Do I take a left? Most likely it's not a fork. It's just a straight road. They got a, a T. There's a road that veers off. The, that's more like what the vision I'm getting. Or do I stop right here and I take a right? 
And they say, you know what? I'm going to lose no matter what. What if on this road is and I feel like that's a materialistic person. So what if I, I stay on this road and that's where the pot of gold is at. If I take go to the right, there is no pot of gold. I lose no matter what. So I give up what's on this road. And they could be traveling with somebody. They'd be like, listen, horse, I'm going to get off right here. I'm going on this road. And if I give up this person and I take off and go after that other person, I lose what I had. And I don't gain nothing over here because then they might not want me. It's, it's one of them situations where they don't want to make a decision. It's in the... They indecisive. They they like do not want to make that decision. Not to mention, <clears throat> not to mention, they what's the word? I like to say. They don't want to face what they don't want to. They're scared to face reality. My God. Magician again. They stuck. They're not moving. <laughs> <laughs> They're stuck at number one. They ain't even moved to number two yet. Oh, no. Oh, no. They don't want to move. They're not making a decision. They don't want to. They, they are like, no, 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 no. Mm. Yes. Mm. I got bad news for them, though. Yeah, I got bad news for them. This one, on this side. It's the devil in reverse. Mm. And the number on that card, 15. The one is a start. You you going you going one is <laughs> how can I put it? In numerology, one is decided to take the first step. I'm going to take one step, at least just one. Yeah, that's what numerology is. You're taking that first step. You're starting that journey. And with the one in numerology, you're hoping to reach abundance. You're hoping to achieve abundance on your way. With the devil in reverse, mm, not good. Not good. Bad news. Oof, out the gate. Out the gate. When you got a, a line of horses and they just mm, imbalance. They got some conflict from somebody. Don't know who. I mean I didn't I didn't do enough calls to really clarify anything. I'm just I'm just reading what, what I what I when I split the, the deck, let me see what's behind here. Oh, yeah. Them or somebody that is associated with them is unreliable. They unskilled. They don't have those skills. They don't have the skills that the person is resonating with does, that's for sure. Possibly a little uneducated. Uh disloyal, unreliable, I think I said that already, lack of common knowledge, translated, common sense. This person wants to roll. They got the bags packed, eight of cups, emotionally,
That's the devil. That's who they're arguing with. That's who they conflict with. Lack of perspective. Disharmony. An antagonistic person. Let me show you. I'm going to show you. Yes. The devil. Okay. Capricorn energy. The Knight of Pentacles. Capricorn energy. Unreliable. They don't want to work. They got no common sense. Same person. They're antagonistic. They want to argue. They want to fight. If they don't get their way, they call, they have a careers. That's what we call in Cajun French. They have a careers. And it's, it's, that's all that is. It's just throw a little tantrum. Man. Oh, they kick their feet. And, oh, yeah, yeah. and sometimes it depends. That cat can get a little bit abusive. You got to watch him. Yeah. You got to watch him. It don't matter, neither. Gender is, is not relevant. It's energy. So, what if you're dealing with that, whether you're a male or a female, you mustn't hit no woman. You mustn't hit her. Just leave. Just say, Vaya con Dios, my love. I hope you have a good life, boo. <laughs> you throw your little clear, your, your clears, and, and okay, and this one right here is the Eight of Cups. You got their bags packed, they're ready to roll. They want out. They want out. They believe that they're being served justice, karma. They believe that, that for whatever they did, whatever, something, they, and it's in the upright. Okay, and this. This is the Empress. Hi, right, my love. In reverse. Yes. Empress. Empress is, is all four queens put together. In reverse. All four queens in reverse. So she devious. Mm. Oh. Not. This could be the person that we talking to that's resonating. Try to get yourself in the upright, my love. You got to. If you're the empress, you got to in reverse. Come on now. You better than that. Dereliction of what you have to do. You like. You letting your emotions control you. You got anxiety. You careless. You spending money like a drunken sailor. Got a lot, a lot of regret. So anyway, let's go ahead and put these back like they was. Mm. And if you, a ma'am, and you have to deal with somebody who's throwing a tantrum and they're not getting their way and a little bit uneducated. You go to the academy and buy you. I ain't into violence. I'm not into violence. I'm not promoting no violence. But sometimes just walk around with a Louisville slugger is enough to calm the craze down. Be like, boy, you put your hands on me one more time. Watch this. Batter up. Put your hands on me again. See what's going to happen. <laughs> Solve that problem quick. You're like, Gotta set your ass down and calm down. You know that? Go over there to McDonald's and the kids' playground, throw your fit. Don't do that over here. Oh, we adults over here. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not. Please don't, don't, don't think I'm, I'm advocating violence. I'm not. <laughs> oh, mercy. Let's see what we got. Oh my goodness, the devil again, in the reverse again. Oh. Hmm. Yep. 
Then I hooked up with somebody. Got the hangman in, in the upright. The hangman in the upright. Then I hooked up with somebody they feel trapped. They like don't know what to do. They can't, they can't figure this out. This, and this is the same energy I've been dealing with for a while now. Devil in reverse. I just told y'all what the devil in reverse was. It's that Capricorn energy. Yeah, totally out of balance. Whoever this is, out of balance. Hmm. Got a change coming. I don't know what, but they got a change coming. Because they got a page involved. Page of Wands. That's a Sagittarius energy. Imagine that. <laughs> Boy, like, they ain't been around our, our readings in a while. Like every reading they in there. Yes. This page is friends with whoever this is. The one that is throwing them fits. The one that is connected with the person that they friends. They, they all friends. It's Sagittarius. That's a friend. That I would be careful. I'm going to tell you this. I would be careful because the hangman, they feel trapped. Poor baby. They, they, whether it's a, a, a ma'am or a sir, a mister or a missus, they feel trapped. They just, just look at the situation and it's like there's no way out. I don't know what to do. And old Sag over here, the page, ain't happening. Not happening, I'm telling you. Be careful what you say to anybody. I learned that lesson the hard way. I mean, a lot of people, I bet you a lot of people that's watching me right now, have, we learned that lesson. Be careful what you say because the page can take it and go talk to the devil in reverse. Be like, listen, this is what they said, and this is what they said, and they want to work things out, and they really don't want to work things out. They want out of the situation. Be like, boo, you want to help me? This is what I need. I need for you to help me get another apartment, rent, and all that other stuff. That's what I need. Oh, yeah, they fight. Oh, this devil in, oh, yeah, the devil in the upright. It's not in the reverse. They fighting. Whew, the bata conflict. Mm -hmm. They got conflict on the devil card. In reverse, they got conflict on that card, and that's like double confirmation. Oh yeah, they just look at each other and they start growling. I'm like, whoa, <laughs> Lord have mercy. Be like, boo. Yeah, they want, they want. Mm -hmm. Let's do another one. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah. And sometimes you just can't help people. You help them, they get right back in the same rut they did, they, they was in. Same thing. Like, golly, boo, I just helped you with that word. And how in the hell are you going? Come on. Now. Oh, uh-uh. <laughs> it's impossible. It's impossible. Yo, see. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. 
Oh, say it ain't so. <laughs> the devil in reverse again. This is the, the most persistent. This is like a cockroach. He keep a fly. That's a fly. He keep bothering me. Come on now. You got to be joking. Let's see what this one is. Oh. Oh, Lord, I'd be so glad when I, I need to. I don't know. Sage had working. Maybe I ought to Clorox this whole room. <laughs> Sanitize the hell out of it. Jesus Christ. Holy smoke. The ace of swords in reverse. Pisces. It's, it's, it's in the air. Air sign. They have signs of air. Pisces. I mean, Pisces is not. The card itself is, I'm talking about. <sighs> Lord, have mercy. Mm. Out in the hell, but somebody gets so stuck in a situation voluntarily, like you know, you, you did that on purpose. I'm gonna tell you the first split we did, there was a card one night stand. This started out as nothing. That started out as I had a few too many drinks. That's what they gonna blame it on. I had a few too many drinks. I didn't use temperance. Overindulged in something. Went to a hotel. Yep. <sighs> and ended up turning into something more. They got whatever this cat is, he's a good talker. They, she, he, them, they, mister, ma'am, missus, sir. They a good talker. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. They sold, they sold an illusion. Mm -hmm. He said, leave that earth angel over that that you had. Whatever that case is, may not have even been an earth angel, hell it, but it it sure was better than this right here. It sure was better than that. But then you got Sag over that page. Hmm. That's that's that name. Nodging, hey, that's non-gender specific name. Mr. Page, Miss Page. Over there, ain't doing a bit of good. And then, Ace of Souls. They feel like a failure. They, they, whoever this is resonating with, and I can't get out of this energy. I wish I could. I want to. In fact, this is the next quarter. They want to move. They 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 want to get the hell out. They out. They like let let me go. Don't call me. Don't talk to me. Don't text. Hmm. Another one. Two cups. Emotional. They want to disconnect emotionally from whoever that is. They want. They. Let's cut the card. Yeah. In fact, I'm gonna pay for a card cutting spell. <laughs> Calling me up over here. I don't my information shows that I got. Uh, hello? Yeah, I wanna do a little card cutting uh yo, yeah, I can show you how to do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not hard. Yeah. 
It's not that hard. We can do that. Mm-hmm. The whole problem is you can't you can't stay with the one you've been cutting the card with. Star in reverse. I mean, it's like one after the other. Paul's bad. They in they in a they in a world of hurt. They stuck. They don't know what to do. God, they incompetent. They they feel like they're incompetent. They feel like a failure. They got no. They like the axe page over there. That's the old page. What the last name is Sage Page Sage or Sage Page, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, Doc them. Can you like give me some ideas? So, yeah, just stay away at them. They okay. They're not that bad of a person. <laughs> well, you stay with him then, or you stay with her. Uh, tell me that shit. I don't hear that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, he get mad when he playing that. That, 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 that PS, what, I don't know what it is now. What's the latest one? The PS5, I think, maybe. I don't know. He over there playing his PS5. He got this Britney Spears on. You know, and he's over there talking. And they're fighting. And one of them war games they got there. That's all he want to do. Well, this person right here we're resonating with, they're working. <laughs> they're hustling. They're trying, to, they're trying to put bread on the table. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. We're fixing to have us a big thing tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. I lose track of days. I'm sick. So my bride won't let me go outside. My feet ain't touched the grass in a while. I don't know. Mm. She said, don't go outside. You're going to get sick. No, I said, I'm already sick, so why well, I can't go outside? She said, you're going to get more sick. I said, hey, I'm going to get more sick. Don't go outside, she said. I'm going to make you some, some tire flu. I'm going to give tire flu a plug. I'm going to make y'all some tire flu. Anyway, we'll split the cards one more time, and we're going to, it's going to be the last split. Yeah, boy. That's the same person right there that was the, the devil. That's the same person. The devil is an energy that This is the king of, of cups right here. In, in reverse. King of cups in reverse. It's the same person that acts very immature. This could, this don't have to be a young fella. I think that they are younger than the person that this is resonating with. I do believe that they are younger. Don't know how, by how far. Possibly 10 years. Possibly 10 years. Maybe more. 15. Because they're immature. They, they, they not, they're not mature in no they're not mature financially. Both of them together, them and the person that's resonating with, is a disaster. They are a disa financial disaster. They're both overspend. They're both financially irresponsible. Both of them don't know how to save. They, they don't know how to save money. No. Disaster. And they both blame it on each other. Conflict, you remember? Just the last the last split. It was a conflict. Most of the time that's what they're fighting about. Money. Cups, pen I mean pinnacles. Yes, this this person is emotionally Yeah. Not good. Not good. 
A page of pentacles. Yep. They got change coming. The world card is there. That's change. Something is coming to an end, a completion. Mm -hmm. Queen in, in uh, I'm sorry, Queen of Pentacles. Hey, boo. Hey, girl. In reverse. Mm. Not good. This, on this side. King of Cups, an adult that hasn't grown up still. This page, this person that this resonate with, they found the King of Cups somewhere, don't know where, at the Starbucks. Playing with his phone, with his earbud. Might have known him for a long time. Actually, might have known him for a very long time. Hey, boo, what's up? Yeah. Yeah, I was still living in my mama's basement. Saw Louisiana, ain't living in no basement, boo. It's going to be flooded, I promise you that. <laughs> you, you dig three feet down, you're going to hit water. <laughs> so, <laughs> you ain't living in no basement. But anyway, still living at mama's. Yeah, they ain't been weaned yet. They, yeah. Well, you know, I just, I don't nurse every day, once a week, but hell, I do nurse. I still nurse. Yeah, well, shit, I'm glad for you, old boy. Oh, girl, ma'am, missus. He, you see, he told this person that's resonated with that he had ten pentacles, that he had him a bag full, or that he was going to have a bag full. He might, you know, he was like, man, he said, I'm telling you, I got an itch and, and I'm, 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 I'm playing the scratch off and I'm going to hit it. I'm telling y'all, just watch. But he ain't hit it yet. And he ain't got, he run out of pinnacles to buy some more scratch offs. So the person this resonated with, the queen she got to give him money to go buy some scratch off so he can try to. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a poor sad. It's a sad story. Sure, this is like General Hospital. It's like as the world turns. Sure. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ah, ten of swords, horse. Yeah, this old boy, he stabbed them in the back. Whoever that's resting. He flallied, he flallied them a, a lick, bro. He put ten swords in their back. They didn't even see that coming. They put some faith in that. They thought that this was going to pay out. But you see, that's what happens. And we're going to close this out, this reading. But that's what happens when you, when you go after something. Go after something that is, if you're going to go after something, go after love. You may not get ten pinnacles. You may not get nine pinnacles. You only may, you might only get one pinnacle from that person. But you can believe one thing. If you go after love and that person loves you, they're going to go borrow some money. 
They're going to help you no matter what because they love you. Ma'am, madam, miss, sir, mister, it doesn't matter. Gender, irrelevant. It goes both ways. If there's a woman, a feminine, I tell you, a female that loves a man and he's down on his luck, I don't believe in luck, but he he down in spirit. She gonna help him. She gonna pick him up. Mm, when his scales get off balance, she gonna balance that scale for him, and she gonna say, "Listen, I'm gonna help you. And when you get back on your feet, we're gonna rock together, you and I." Same goes for the man. Woman's down on her, in her, in her feelings, and. She done found herself in a bad way. Find somebody that's going to help you out. Go with the love. Always go with the love. Don't go with the bullshit illusionist. Mm -mm. No, it's... And always go with the short sure shot. Number one. Follow your intuition. The gut. Don't listen to your friends. Your friends don't know everything. Mm -mm. If I have a friend, I'm going to tell you this. If I have a friend, and I love my friends, I get close to my friends. If I have a friend, ain't nobody going to talk no trash to me about my friends. I'm going to show them the road. Not even family. Family not going to talk trash about my friends. I don't ask you to help my friends. I'll help them. Simple as that. I hope y'all enjoyed this reading. Always follow love. There's a description of love in scripture. Look it up. Look it up. The best one given is the one that Jesus gave, the golden rule. Love God with all your heart. Your mind, with all your soul. And he says, to love your neighbor as yourself. And that's what you should do. You should treat others the way you want to be treated. Then you don't have to worry about karma. Karma's going to avoid you and pass right by you like a bolt of lightning going after somebody else. Because you're going to get what you give if you help and if you avoid hurting other people, if you try to absorb some hurt from someone else, it pays off in the long run. I love each and every one of you. Every one of you. Thank you for watching me and for supporting my channel and support. I don't mean money. I do not accept money. But just by watching me, you support me. Even them haters. I love my haters. Don't y'all leave my haters alone. They they watch me close too. I damn it. I like them. I love them. Shit, yeah. I don't want no more of them though. <laughs> I got enough of that. I got plenty. <laughs> I'm not going to make another video tonight. I did this one a little early. Uh, moving night tonight at the camp. Me and my bride are gonna watch a movie. Maybe I don't. I'm not sure if her friend coming over state tonight. Cause supposed to have something going on this weekend. She gonna come. Not too sure. I don't know how, it, how it's all working out. Yeah, I ain't got the details, but she do stay quiet a bit. Boudreaux. <laughs> yeah, actually, that's that, that's her maiden name, Boudreaux. And she know who she is. Peace out. I love y'all.